Speaker, today I had the honour to stand with Constable Wynne's widow, who was in Ottawa, to talk about the importance of Wynne's Law. Wynne's Law would close a loophole in the criminal code that helped cost Constable Wynne his life. I know that the Minister of Justice met with Ms. McInnes Wynne, and I thank her for that. But since the Minister opposes Wynne's Law, can the Minister explain just when it's okay for the criminal history of a bail applicant not to be disclosed. Yeah. Yeah. Honourable Minister of Justice. Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, first of all, I, as, as the member opposite said, I had the great pleasure to sit down with Mrs. Wynne, and I want to reiterate in this House um, uh, an acknowledgement and great empathy for the loss that she has suffered. We spoke about um, what we're doing, what I'm committed to doing in terms of modernizing the criminal justice system, improving the efficiencies and effectiveness, and ensuring that we look at bail reform. That is why I'm working with my counterparts in the provinces and territories. That is why we've empowered the steering committee on justice efficiencies to look at specific aspects of bail reform, and we are going to continue to move forward collaboratively.